everyone. I really um, felt to share my heart um, tonight about being single on Valentine's Day. And the reason I wanted to share about this is because I was on Facebook and I saw everyone's news feed and I saw all the, um, just the photos and um, of people getting gifts, of people getting engaged, of just all the interaction on Facebook about Valentine's Day. And it started having a crazy voice to me. And it started having a voice to me of, look at you. Where is your husband? Where is your boyfriend? And Jesus immediately spoke to my heart. And he immediately spoke truth to me and said, you're mine. You're my beloved. You are complete in me. So I just wanted to encourage you that no matter where you're at in your relationship status, that you are Jesus's. You are made for God. You are his. You're his beloved. And you're his beloved son. You're his beloved daughter. And that we're first complete in Christ before we have that one or we have that other one that we First, have to receive his love, his glory, his good opinion, and let him heal us in some places before we reach out and have another relationship. So I just felt to share it with you that you're not alone, that you're Jesus' beloved, and you're made for him, and that you're complete in Christ. And if you're feeling lacking in any area today because of all the hype of Valentine's Day, know that you are Jesus' Valentine. You're his favorite, that he saw you, that you were the joy that was set before him, that if you were the only one, he would have done it just for you. So I want to encourage you to sit with Jesus let him love on you. Let him heal some places in your heart that he knows have need healing. He knows everything you've been through. He knows everything that you've been through. He co-lives this life with you. Our Father, Son, Holy Spirit co-live this life with you. And they know what you're thinking and they know what you're feeling and they need they know the truth you need to be convinced of. So let him convince you today. Let him convince you that you're not lacking anything, that you're complete in Christ, that you are perfect, that you're beautiful, that you're wanted, accepted, loved, and treasured, that you're his, that you're made for him, that you're the bride of of Christ. Even if you are a son, you're still the bride of Christ. So I just want to encourage you that you're not lacking anything. Today of all days is no different. You know, thank God that everyone is, you know, showing outpour of loving, but our Father showed His heart for us when Jesus went to the cross for us. That's where we look to. We look to the Godhead, that Jesus Christ and the Godhead is the only truth about us today. So if you're feeling lacking in any area, take your heart to Jesus, have a Trinity meeting, and let him persuade you that you are his beloved, that in you he is well pleased, and how perfect you are, and let him heal your heart in the ways and places he knows you need healing. So happy Valentine's Day to you. Just a quick little message to tell you that you are his valentine that you are his favorite you are his beloved he can't get enough of you he delights in you he hangs in every word that you say and all his thoughts to you are for good and you're loved you are loved and treasured and wanted so have a great night and know you're loved thank you so much